It is great to be with you on this Saturday morning. I'm Dan Pope looking forward to a quiet day here in Salt Lake City, but some of our big football games that are happening today, for example, Ohio State and Michigan, there's a little bit of stormy weather heading through that region. In fact, snowing across much of lower Michigan and also some rain and snow in Iowa with big rains heavy at times coming into Houston and parts of Dallas, Fort Worth. Now in the West, more heavy rain in the Pacific Northwest. You can see this storm track is coming up over ridge of high pressure and then as it dives down, there's no storm energy. These little weak weather systems brush by, but they only bring a few clouds and you'll see them this morning. You might even see in the next 15 minutes, a really nice underneath shot of the sun coming in under those clouds. So be ready for a great sunrise. You can see it here starting to come out, breaking clouds, a little bit of haze, maybe a little more than a little bit of haze. Let's just call it hazy today. And you can see from the Intermountain camera, the haze across the valley. Another view, this is the one I'm telling you. You've got clearing skies here on this side of the Wasatch Mountains. When the sun starts to come up for a few minutes right here, just before eight o'clock, we're going to see some nice, beautiful undercloud uh, sunrise could be really bright, orange, yellow, red, those kinds of colors. 28 in Salt Lake City, 31 in Ogden, 22 in Provo. Kind of cold there in Provo this morning. How about our temperatures in Roosevelt and uh, also price into the 20s? Mo Nephi is 19 this morning. Kimmer is 27. Uh, 18 degrees at Bryce Canyon. That's not unusual, but a bit on the chilly side, Moab 18. Here's the ridge of high pressure. It is right over the top of San Francisco. Let's go into Tuesday, Monday into Tuesday. A little weak storm, very weak storm comes by. That may stir up the air a little bit, help to clear out the haze. But this ridge is sitting right over the top of California Friday. And then we go into Sunday. Another weak storm system comes by on Sunday. A little stronger storm. This one looks like it may break the ridge down. This is happening on uh, Tuesday. So approaching storm on Tuesday, that'll kick the winds up. Any haze in the valley will be gone. So look forward to a change about the 7th, 8th, 9th, maybe 10th of the month of December. I know that's a ways off. Mostly 20s this morning, 30s until 11 a.m., 44 degrees at noon, high of 42 in Vernal, 47 Salt Lake, 49 Cedar City, Ely 55. You know there's an inversion when Ely is 55 and Salt Lake City's in the 40s. There's your seven-day forecast for St. George. It's seven days, okay, six days in the 60s, one day today, 59. Salt Lake City, Ogden, Provo, along the Wasatch Front, upper 40s and haze today, tomorrow, Sunday, Monday. A little bit of a break in the haze, but still highs in the 40s. Average high this time of the year, though, John, is 44. So we're not that bad, maybe five degrees above average, actually. Yeah, we're waiting for that snow, but again, have to be patient this time this, of year. Yeah, for that we're going to be very patient. It's coming, <laughs> but not in the near term. All right, thanks so much, Dan.